Hello, it's Dr. Gay from First Click MRI, and this is a 66-year-old female with knee pain, no history of injury, and we see here she has a tear of her medial meniscus in the posterior horn. This is the posterior horn, here's the anterior horn, and we see this vertical band. If we put on the sagittal T2 fat suppressed sequence, lateral meniscus is looking great. Medial meniscus, however, has that fluid-filled gap right here, and so if we follow this towards the central part. This is um, right, it looks like in the middle third going into the inner third and the next cut over. It looks like it, the inner third is blunted and so the question is what kind of tear is it? What do we call this? And it turns out this is a parrot beak type tear. It almost looks like a radial tear but it's obliquely oriented and we can see this on the axial sequence. On the axial sequence, if we go over here, we're going to see it on the medial side here towards the back. And this is it right here. So the meniscus here is the anterior horn, body, posterior horn, and this is the component that is torn up. And the little fluid collection we saw was right here going obliquely, almost horizontally. And so this, instead of having a radial tear that is uh, in the radial direction, perpendicular to the long axis here, this is obliquely oriented and you can see it looks like a parrot beak. So this is a parrot beak type tear of the posterior horn of the medial meniscus. On the coronal view here, it just looks like a complex tear, really can't tear, tell what kind of tear it is. On the sagittals, it looks kind of like a radial tear, but just uh, not quite um, the same. Have a funny look where it looks like a, a vertical tear. And on the axial images here, we confirm that it is indeed an obliquely oriented radial type tear called a parrot beak tear. Thank you very much.